Hello friends, I know most of you might have filed your income tax return and now eagerly you might be waiting for your income tax return. So in this video, I am going to tell you when your income tax refund will be released by income tax department, why your friend has received but you have not received, where you can find the status of your income tax refund and what to do if there are any issues with your refund or your refund might have stuck for any reason. Now last fourth, fourth point I will tell you next video that's why I want you to subscribe my channel so that when I release my next video in which I will tell you all the issues possible issues and solutions if your refund has been stuck. So please subscribe now so that you can get the update for my next video and please forward to all other friends also let's begin. So friend first thing first when generally the income tax uh, refund is issued nowadays. So the most important part now 31st July is a cutoff date to file your income tax return. Once you file your return generally the income tax department uh, process the uh, return now within 7 to 10 days and if there is no issues generally you receive your refund within 15 days. So most of you if, if there is no issue by 15th of August might have received their refund and if you have not received the refund yet then I will tell you uh, how to check the status how to check if there is an issue uh, in upcoming points. So generally the government has re uh, reduced the number now this is 10 to 15 days generally you receive but understand sometimes it takes more time because there may be some information which is missing okay. So let me again tell you the process procedure which is followed by income tax department so that you understand why uh, some people receive income tax refund early why some people receive late okay how basically it works what is the income tax department's procedure to issue the refund. So the first thing once you file your return generally they do a automatic assessment. This automatic assessment is now mostly done by system itself which is and then they issue a kind of uh, you can say assessment order. That assessment order is called intimation. Now intimation is not detail analysis it's just the system based processing where department just check the uh, your return on few criteria like your income your TDS deducted and all it everything and generally generally this intimation order is issued without involvement of any human being or without invo involvement of your of any income tax officer. So 7 to 10 days system checks it your return if there is no issue then they start issuing the refund okay. So this is the process. So first thing how much refund you get it? This all depends on this intimation. Sometimes what happened, for example, you have claimed a refund of say 40,000. But in your income tax portal itself, the total TDS deducted is 20,000 only. So you will only receive 20,000 refund, not 40,000 rupees. So uh, another point is here, suppose you want to check like, like if you received a refund less than what you have claimed and you want to know where to check the calculation, the intimation order is the place where you can check it. I will show you the intimation order also in this video itself and I will show you how the how you can check the calculation done by you and how the calculation done by income tax system. So both the calculation are basically shown parallel and then you can understand very well why your refund is less than what you you are expecting. Now in some cases people may receive slightly more refund also. So the same system works there plus in some cases government also gives interest if your refund is delayed. So this is the first important part that how the refund is issued. Now some people have always this question sir my friend has received refund lots of my friend or most of my friend has received the refund but my refund is not done. Have I done something wrong is it something about some post which I made against the government. Uh, so there is nothing like that basically you understand uh, generally more than 1 crore 1 crore plus refunds are issued small or big and uh, the whole ref uh, refunds cannot be processed in one lot. So generally what happens they process all the refunds on the lot basis. Generally what they do the smaller refund they process earlier and the bigger refund where the amount is like 1 lakh 2 lakh or something like that they process it slowly because they want to check it thoroughly before issuing the big refunds. So there can be 2-3 criteria why your refund is getting delayed. Maybe your refund return has been filed late. That's why the refund will also process late. So suppose somebody filed in the month of June and somebody filing the return at 31st of July, possibly both returns will not process together. 
second as i told you it is a batch wise so every batch consider a, a number of you can say refunds which is processed together together there may be certain criteria but exactly i don't know what is the criteria income tax department uses uh, so batch wise processing happening and that's why it may be possible or your friends are first in first batch that's why they got their income early refund early and you may be next or next to next batch so it may take time third as i told you there may be the level of refunds so if refund is bigger chances are they will scrutinize more before releasing the money so that can also be a reason so there are two three reasons why the refund is getting delayed if i say before 30th of september if you have not received your refund do not panic because income tax department generally takes that much time so maybe uh, your refund is going to come in next month but if it is not received till 30th september don't panic but yes if it is not received after 31st 30th uh, september without any issue from your side or without showing any issue in the platform so i will show you in next video what is the issue generally happens when the fund is getting delayed so so that you can resolve it now itself you don't have to wait that till 30 september but again so if in your income tax portal there is no issue is reported and still you have not received the refund till 30th september don't bo uh, worry about it if it is more than 30th september definitely you should be worried and then i will tell you i will make a video that if your refund is getting delayed without giving any reason then what you can do what action you can do in maybe one video i will definitely explain or you can put your questions if you have any like any issues are reporting in your income tax refund just put that issue as a question to us in comment section my team or i will come back and i will definitely reply how to resolve all those issues so two things i told you already when your refund will uh, be issued so generally it is uh, now they are issuing within 15 days but in some cases it can be delayed don't bother if there is no issue and you have not received till 30th september another good thing I, I will tell you that generally if your return is delayed after a certain period government generally gives you some return uh, some interest on the refund part so you, do, you don't lose all right at least you get the bank saving account interest rate on that now third question where to check and how to check your income tax refund that's i'm going to tell, tell you in my screen so let's go to screen and check how can you can log in uh, either income tax portal or nsdl website and check the status and rectify it so friend as you can see in my screen you just have to log in into your income tax portal and directly you can go know your status refund status here this screen will come and then you have to select the year the year is 2000 24 25 submit here and you will get the status that like in this, this case if you see this is already the refund is issued on 29 july itself and then you can the bank account is also generally uh, mentioned so with the utr and number you can definitely track your refund so what is the refund so this is a one way you can check your refund directly logging into your income tax portal so go to income tax portal in services know your refund status put the assessment here you want to know and go to submit and you will get it now second way is suppose you don't have time to log in into system so what you can do you can simply so the next next option suppose you don't want to log in all the time to check the system is you can go on this nsdl uh, website tin.tinnsdl.com all it has or you can simply search on the google like uh, you can search refund status nsdl and uh, there you just have to put your pan number your pan card and on the captcha code you proceed and you will get the refund status here also so there are two way i told you i can you can check your status now before you go i can i also want to tell you another thing what if your you have received a less refund as calculated in your income tax so you're expecting say 40000 you receive only 20000 and you want to know why on this earth somebody stole your 20000 rupees and you want to check it so i will tell you in the same case also you have to go to your income tax portal again i will take it uh, take take you to the income tax portal login there so here you have to go to uh, your uh, dashboard and uh, on the dashboard you have to go to income tax return view income tax return and from there you go you have to go to view uh, view file return so you, in the file return section if you see this return all status will be declared for the assessment year 2024 25 and here you can see the intimation download this intimation 
and in the intimation itself there will be calculation so i already have downloaded so i will show you uh, you have to put your password the password is basically your pan number in small date of birth and date of, uh, date of birth so that you put it and it will open so let me show you how this intimation order uh, look like and where you check you where you can check the calculation so here you can so here you can check it and basically in the calculation itself uh, when you download this whole thing then uh, you can simply check it uh, let me reduce it a bit for you so here is that let me reduce so you can check you can watch it properly so here you can see this uh, whole uh, uh, calculation here basically the income what you have declared and what is the tax liabilities if there is additional interest or fees payable which is deducted so in this case if you see the calculation provided by taxpayer and computation done by department both are same uh, in your case if you have received the less refund then you can check it here and here definitely they will calculate suppose there is something you missed out or some penalty or interest they have added then in that case you will receive the less refund but you can see the calculation in the intimation which is generally uh, sent by income tax department uh, in your portal itself download open it and check the all calculation and there itself you will understand what is basically uh, the difference was there but still if you have some question like why this penalty was levied why the interest was levied why my ref ref uh, refund was different please uh, send me uh, your question in the comment section and i will definitely or my team will definitely come back and reply uh, that what may be the reason for that in next video friends i will tell you what are the issues if your refund is stuck so basically there can be a lot of issues for example the ref the tax deducted by your company is not deposited uh, there may be reason that your bank account is not updated or verified so lots of issues can be there so if any one of you i i hope everybody received their refund on time but still if somebody has not received the refund then please subscribe to my channel and watch the next video where i will i will uh, explain you all the issues which can happen which can prevent your refund um, getting directly into your bank account and how to resolve all these issues that i'm going to talk in this video so in this in this video friends that's all if you have any other queries please put as the comments that's all in this video Thank you. Have a nice day.